We carry our lives on this one device, on our phones now. And what if I were to tell you that very soon you'll be able to carry all your cryptos and NFT on your smartphone as well. That's right, your phone will soon act as your crypto wallet. Hi there, I'm Sonal Merotra Kapoor and let's talk about the first ever crypto smartphone. A smartphone where you can experience Web3, Metaverse, where you will have that alongside your conventional apps. Basically, you can do all things crypto from your phone. So let's dive in. To make the life of over 100 million holders of the digital assets more convenient, Solana has introduced Saga, a flagship Android phone with unique functionality and features tightly integrated with the Solana blockchain. Now, this blockchain-focused smartphone aims at making the whole crypto experience simpler and more secure. Solana, as we know, is one of the fastest-growing ecosystems in crypto, with thousands of projects spanning DeFi, NFTs, Web3, and many more. Saga will enable users to do Web3 transactions on mobile, carry digital assets around anywhere with you, store cryptocurrencies in your pockets literally, and even NFTs. Pay for purchases all through Solana Pay and sign for transactions from anywhere, anytime. That, folks, is going to be a reality very soon. The Saga phone comes with a software platform called the Solana Mobile Stack, or what they call is SMS. The stack will simplify the job of developers as it provides key technologies for building Android applications on the Solana network itself. The SMS or the Solana mobile stack will also enable minting of NFTs anywhere, anytime and will also allow users to play Solana-based Web3 video games on your phone. So in order to make Web3 apps accessible on a large scale, Solana App Store or the DAP store as they call it, will provide a distributed channel for these applications, allowing developers to transact without platform fee, which is impossible, by the way, on any other app store like Google Play or even the Apple App Store. And I'm sure by now you're wondering, all right, all these features are going to be there, but what exactly does the phone look like? Well, it looks exactly like your smartphone, any other phone in the market. Saga will have about 6.67 inches of OLED display, 12 GB RAM and a massive 512 GB storage as well and the latest uh, Snapdragon 8 Plus Generation 1 mobile platform. And what else it has to offer? Well, it also has the mobile wallet adapter. Let's talk about that in detail. This protocol will actually link mobiles and web applications to the blockchain wallet. It also has the seed vault. It keeps all your sensitive information away from the web and stores it securely. This includes the private keys of your crypto wallets that are required to authorize transactions. Also it has, which is soon going to be everybody's favorite, Solana Pay, a decentralized payment system that will facilitate a wallet adapter and allow for QR code based on-chain payments. Also it will have Web3 App Store, the stack also comes with a decentralized app store with a distribution channel allowing developers to directly reach users on their phones and this will eliminate the need for users to shell out payment fee on any other platform. And why is this revolutionary? Well, if you haven't guessed it, Web3 is not made for smartphones and you do need at this moment a desktop browser to take full advantage of it. So. Excited much to grab this next generation crypto smartphone in your hands? Well, it will start shipping in early 2023 and is priced at $1,000. It will be pre-ordered from the Solana official website as well with a $100 fully refundable deposit. But, and here's a twist of the tale, if you can't wait till then, we've got on this program another option for you. Well, we have another smartphone lined up to launch in September of 2022 
and this is going to be a famous smartphone maker HTC. Now following Saga's announcements, HTC has also teased now the Desire 22 Pro which is going to focus mainly on the metaverse. This crypto smartphone will enable users to manage their metaverse content, cryptocurrencies, NFTs and much more. Moreover, the Vivas app in the phone will enable users to create their own virtual space and purchase NFTs in the virtual market space. What's more interesting is that the expected price of HTC's crypto smartphone will be less than half of Solana Saga. While Saga will cost you around 78,000 in Indian rupee terms, the cost of Desire 22 Pro will just be about 30,000. All right, so not one, but two crypto smartphones are going to hit the market in the next 12 to 15 months. Are you excited about it? Tell us in the comments below. For now, thank you for watching Money Control and stay tuned to the channel.